Hello WordPress enthusiasts and welcome to episode number 4 of the new plugin series. My name is Robert and I use WordPress since 2011 when I was looking for a flexible way to create and manage my own website. That's how I discovered WordPress and since then I've tested hundreds of themes and plugins. Lately I started looking for new plugins and today I discovered some really interesting tools for collecting emails, organizing your media library and adding dynamic year and month to your site. So this is the first plugin in this video called Slide to Subscribe. It has built-in free email verification and bot detection, which means that you are significantly less likely to fall into spam traps and throwaway emails are automatically rejected. The built-in bot detection ensures that only real humans subscribe to your email list. Once activated, you will see this slide to subscribe tab on your dashboard where you need to get your ID before moving forward. Then you can copy and paste this short code where you want to display the slide and subscribe form. Let me see what's happening if I use it on an incognito window of Chrome. I thought it would ask for email address. If people are connected to their Google account on Chrome, when doing this, the form will collect their email address automatically from there. You as the site administrator can see the list of subscribers in your account on slide to subscribe.com. It's nice that you can sync your subscribers with services like MailChimp, SendGrid, ConvertKit and so on. Also, you can get a unique subscribe to whatever you want URL and add this link to a simple button, for example. Cool. Now we can move to the next plugin, which is Happy Files WordPress Media Categories. It could be a nightmare to organize your media files if you are uploading such files every day. With this tool, you can organize your entire media library via drag and drop in nestable categories and arrange thousands of files as you would do on your computer. Now that you have your images properly organized, you would want to optimize them for speed and lazy load each image only when people scroll down on your pages and posts. Optimoly gives you just that and even more automatically. Picks the right image size for the visitor's browser and viewport in real time and serves your images via a fast image CDN. Let's move to the last plugin in this video, which is dynamic month and year into posts. As its name implies, this tool allows you to add the current year by using a shortcode in your posts or pages. If you are using Nevi, which is our speedy WordPress theme, you can open its footer settings in the customizer and use this dynamic tag list to display the current year and many other things. But if you want to do that on posts or pages, you can use the year shortcode. For example, if you drag over the shortcode widget of Elementor over here and paste this shortcode into the field, the year 2020 will show up, which is the current year when I'm recording this video. That's it for today. If you like this kind of video and want to see more, please subscribe and leave a comment below to tell me what kind of plugins and themes you want to see in future videos. Keep up the good work and see you in the next one. Cheers!